Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to check your iPhone warranty expiration date. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, if you have a used iPhone, say you bought a used iPhone on eBay or Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace, or it's your iPhone that you've had since purchasing, but you forgot when the warranty expires, there's a couple of different ways to check that warranty. One is in the settings itself of your iPhone, and then if it's already expired, there is a way to check the exact date that it did expire on a website that I'll show you. So the very first thing to check the actual expiration date or whether it's expired is to head into settings here. So when we're in settings, we'll scroll down until you hit general and we'll tap on that. And then at the very top, you can see about, we'll tap on about. And now keep in mind, you need the latest iOS 15 for this to pop up. So if you have an older version of iOS, you might need to update the software to be able to see this. But if you do, you can see right under serial number is coverage. So it says coverage expired and I can tap on that. And it says my current coverage is expired. So if you're, iPhone coverage, your warranty is still valid. It'll show you a date there where you know it expires that expiry date for your iPhone coverage. But if it's expired, it doesn't really tell you when it expired. It could have been yesterday, it could have been two years ago, you don't know. However, there's a way to check exactly when it did expire. So we'll go back one and then we will go to serial number and tap and hold on that and we'll hit copy. So then we'll get out of there and then we're gonna open up Safari. You can use Chrome as well. And I like iunlocker.com, the letter I, unlocker.com. And then you go to that website at the very top right, you can see the hamburger menu. We'll tap on that and hit check IMEI. So here you can either use the IMEI or serial number and we will paste in that serial number there and check it. It takes, you know, 10 to 15 seconds to pull up all that information. And you can see if I scroll down, it gives me all kinds of information about this specific phone itself, including the expiration date of the warranty, which was April 21st, 2022. So a little less than a month ago. Um, and you can see the estimated purchase date, April 22nd. 2021, so you get a year warranty from when it was initially activated for iPhone, you know, on the iPhone network and everything. So this is a good way to be able to check that iPhone expiry date for the warranty if when you go into the settings, it doesn't necessarily tell you when it expired. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.